And now to vote 2022, and we are officially less than 24 hours away from the polls opening here in Florida. It comes after early voting ended on Sunday. Candidates were out in full force over the weekend, and today they are making their final push. And Local 10 News reporter Trent Kelly starts our team coverage off here at the Miami-Dade Supervisor of Elections Office in Doral. Are they ready for everything to happen tomorrow? They are ready and they want voters to be ready as well. You know, the candidates, they are going to be very busy over the next day or so crisscrossing our area, trying to get their last minute message out to voters with that early voting period here in Florida now officially over. All eyes are turning towards tomorrow with matchups that will not only decide who controls Congress, but also whether Florida will be getting a new governor. One last call for early voters on Sunday night, right before the end of early voting in South Florida. Daryl Dennis casting his midterm ballot early in Miami Gardens to avoid any election day crowds. Voting early is easier than waiting until the actual day, because then it's a longer process. <laughs> Some Democrats dancing to the voting booth as faith leaders organize the traditional Souls to the Polls events. I pray you will bless us with good health. While bad weather on Sunday caused Democratic Congresswoman and Senate candidate Val Demings to cancel a stop in Miami Gardens, her opponent, incumbent Marco Rubio, appeared at a Republican rally at the Miami Dade Fairgrounds. Miami. This is a great honor for Marco, I can tell you. The headliner there, former President Donald Trump. And that's what this election's about. Because if these people stay in power, they will destroy the greatest country in the history of the world, and we will not allow it. Notably absent was Republican Governor Ron DeSantis, who held his own rally in Sarasota. As in Florida, you know, we're proudly a law and order state, and I'm proudly a law and order governor. And that's what you need. There it is. Democratic Congressman Charlie Crist looking to oust DeSantis, gearing his last minute message towards undecided voters in Miami. Very excited, yeah, looking forward to it. Everybody get out and vote, and this is happening. And Val Demings and Charlie Crist will be holding one last get out the vote event tonight in Hollywood, while Governor DeSantis will be speaking in Hialeah. That's the latest from the Supervisor of Elections Office in Doral. I'm Trent Kelly, Local 10 News.